Right, John um, Arsenal, he left Ozil on the bench. He came on late on and missed the sitter. Uh, Sanchez didn't feature either. And it looked to me like he'd put a team out, uh, perhaps in anticipation that both of those players, Ozil and Sanchez, uh, can talk to other clubs in January. Um, yeah. But uh, when well you saw the game, mm. I mean, I wouldn't say Watford were undeserving winners, although the penalty was a disgrace. Yeah, <coughs> yeah. well, Arsenal, you'd expect more from Arsenal, Eamon. Yep. And, and I think it's, uh, there's been no solution to the problems that they had at the end of last season. Is Ozil going? Is Sanchez going? Is he going to stay? Actually, it's in a bigger mess now than it was at the start of the season. Because they're talking now, Sanchez is not actually playing. Uh, Ozil is in and out of the team. And it, it, it doesn't help for a settled club. I mean, because yeah. we're coming to the window now at Christmas. Is Sanchez going to go? Is he not going to go? This has been going on for 12 months. Yeah. Now, I think you've got to make a decision. Sanchez goes, Ozil goes, gets in, gets somebody else in, and a brand new start. I thought that's what would happen at the, at the uh, pre-season, and it hasn't happened. So, Arsenal are in a, in, in a bigger mess now than they've ever been before. And, again, that's never good for a club. It shows itself on the pitch, and I think that's what's happening at Arsenal at the moment. 